Hello there, the recovery guru here, hope all is well. Today we are working on this uh, older SanDisk USB flash drive. Uh, the customer says that he had it in the computer and somehow he hit it and it got bent. Um, it's difficult to see but there's a crack here in the board that's preventing the drive, the flash drive from working correctly. Um, See, this is the other side. It's difficult to see, uh, but the crack is in, in an area where there's a bunch of components. The crack is right here somewhere, where a bunch of components are located. We tried to fix it. Uh, we ran different wires um, from the power connector, data lines, and so on, trying to get the flash drive to work. But uh, it doesn't. It powers on, but the data doesn't come up. So what we ended up doing is, so what we ended up doing is actually finding a donor USB flash drive that we had in stock. We removed its um, data chip, and then we transplanted the one from the customer, from the patient, onto that onto that one. Um, this was actually the original board that the customer. Um, chip was on so now we transfer to our donor which is no longer here it's actually connected to the machine running let me show you here's the flash drive right here initially we tried to clone using um deep spar that didn't go well the machine would just power on and off consistently uh, we tried connecting to the computer normally the data will pop up but then the drive will dismount so the best way to do it is to use a PC thousands uh, USB adapter, and so we got the cloning process going. The flash drive is slow uh, because it has issues, but it is uh, it is uh, running and it is cloning. So uh, out of all the methods, as you can see here, it's initializing correctly with the correct capacity. Out of all the methods, this was the combination that works best. Uh, so this recovery should be good. Should have a successful recovery and uh, the customer should be happy. Uh, the way we did it is, besides the donor compatible flash drive we had in stock, we used hot air gun to basically remove the chip and then put the other one back on. And uh, this got the flash drive in working condition. If you need professional help anywhere in the United States or locally in Massachusetts, you can ship to us or you can locally drop off anywhere in Boston or Cambridge or Denver, Massachusetts, just go to datarecoveryguru.com and click on the blue button, fill out the form, and that's